lovely evening tonight. I'm so humbled and touched um, to be here. Like Mother says, having nine of us, get to the point, Alec. So <laughs> that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, last fall, my agent called me to tell me about this new young designer who wanted to meet me. His name was Dema. Okay, like they always butcher people's names, so I'm not going to do that to you, Demna. His name is Demna Bazala, and he was casting his show for Balenciaga. So I went and I Googled him to learn about the full story of Vetma. I absolutely love that name. And how he came to, the creative direct, to be the creative director at Balenciaga. Bazala. Let's be honest, when he first came on the scene, no one could pronounce his name. <laughs> I discovered that Demna had grown up in a war-torn Soviet Georgia. Coming from South Sudan, I know a thing or two about revolution. I learned that Demna was not just an incredible designer, but someone who has faced much of the fear and strive I had known so well as a child. He too had made a treacherous escape, leaving everything behind to start a new life. I told my agent that I had to meet this guy. It's really beautiful what Demna clothes bring out in a person. As a woman, I really feel that he cares about you as an individual. He's fun, respectful, and present, which is very important. There was purity and excitement and a sense of creative purpose I had forgotten about. In many ways, the clothes Demna design are very much like the sensitive and visionary person he is. At first glance, they appear very basic, but in reality are quite complex. They speak to the zygest of the world around us and transform the everyday into something quite unique. Working with Demna inspired me to come back into fashion. It's an honor to present the International Award to Demna Vazela. <laughs> For as long as I remember, um, for as long as I can remember, I've liked, I loved clothes, uh, dressing, trying out looks, changing them constantly. As a child, I didn't know that there was such a profession as fashion designer. I would have dreamt of becoming one for sure. I could never do this job without such a fascination of how clothes can change us and how we can use them as powerful tools of communication and self-expression. We work in a fast-paced, demanding and often stressful industry but we keep on doing it because we truly love this job. My hope is that we can continue to move fashion forward by acknowledging the importance of its human factor. Thank you, François-Henri Pinot, for trusting my vision at Balenciaga. Thank you, Guram, for your dedication, for your strength and belief in Vetements. Thanks to my teams, and in particular to Martina, for giving you all for, to, to what we do together. And last but not least, thank you CFDA for recognizing my work with this great award which I dedicate to my late grandmother who always believed in me unconditionally. This is for you, Nora. Thank you. <laughs> 